Hey guys, it's Max here. Welcome to LDM TV. Today we're cooking a very popular recipe from the blog, peanut butter chicken stir fry. This recipe is high in protein, high in fat and moderate on the carbs. Let's get cooking. We're going to do the chicken the easy way today, so I'm not going to fry it, I'm going to use the foreman. I'm going to turn that on and then prepare the chicken so this is nice and ready to cook. Just going to get the loose bit, the loose ends off the chicken before I butterfly it. Get that nasty fat or little bits of ends off. Just be careful butterflying it so you don't chop off your fingers. One done. So now I'll just place these onto the foreman. Close the lid, and I'm going to put that on for 10 minutes. Put this to one side. And wash my hands. So I don't get poisoned. Now we're going to prepare the vegetables. We've got a ready-made vegetable stir-fry. Again, I like to take the easy route. This has got in it cabbage, carrot, broccoli, and a tiny bit of onion. We're just going to add two bell peppers and a half a green and half a red onion. We're going to chop this into nice big bits. Again, a little slice in the top. Helps you get the skin off nice and easy. Just before we put this on the stir fry, we are going to prepare the sauce. So what we need is 40 to 50 grams of peanut butter. We're going to need a little bit of boiling water just to melt this down. So I'm just going to stick the kettle on as well. I'm going to go just a quick five grams of oil and a smattering of the cayenne pepper. Check the chicken. I could do with a little flip. We don't want the chicken crispy, we just want it done enough so that when we put it in with the rest of the ingredients, it comes a nice, good texture for a stir fry. Whilst the kettle's boiling, we're just gonna get the pan on a nice high heat, ready to cook the vegetables. Touch of oil. The kettle's boiled, we're gonna add 30 grams of water to the mix. Just stir it through until the mixture's one. Pan should be nice and heated up. Just spread the oil around a bit. And in goes the pepper and the onion to reduce. Give that a little push around the pan. And we're just gonna chop the chicken up, ready to put that in. So get it off the foreman. Again, we're just gonna cut that lengthways, sideways, and then we'll plonk these in the pan if you're using other ingredients like soy sauce, herbs, spices, this would be a good time to add them. We're going to add the vegetable stir fry that I've just got ready made from Tesco just to add some more volume to this meal. We're going to go for around three quarters of the pack for serving two people. Get that nice and mixed in. We're just going to fry this off on the high heat for about three to four minutes just to get all the vegetables nice and soft and then we're going to add the sauce. Just get that mixed through. At this point you might be asking when or what grains I'm going to have, what noodles I'm going to have with this meal. I've got three options over there. You can have traditional rice, it's got long grain and wild here. That's going to take too long now. You've got the whole grain microwave option, but what I'm going to go for is rice noodles. So I can just throw them in and mix it all up. I'm going to go for the whole pack. These take around three minutes. So let's just get them in there. 
and it's almost time to eat. The moment of truth, let's give this a taste. Mmm. Boiling, but mmm. Mmm.